hello guys welcome back to my channel or welcome if this is your first time here in today's video i am showing a number of different ways that you can use the pink stuff paste this product has quickly become my favorite and i want to show you everything i use it on so make sure you stick around until the end and let's just jump straight into it I think this has actually been one of my favourite discoveries is that you could brighten your trainers with the pink stuff paste and it just makes them so white and clean and it honestly took me about 5 to 10 minutes just scrubbing it on with a toothbrush and all of the mud and dirt and everything literally just melted off of it and yeah it was just so satisfying to watch I definitely recommend this if your trainers are looking a little bit worse for wear definitely use this miracle paste on them because it honestly makes them so white I even tried it on the bottom of the shoe just to see how much it could get off and it really does work wonders so this one is definitely one of my favorites so now moving on to the hob and i already know that the pink stuff paste works really well in the oven so i thought i would give it a go on these because as you can see they're looking a little bit dingy and it just stuck on dirt and everything and i honestly didn't think i'd be able to get them looking as good as i did but this stuff just made them good as new as you can see it's just shiny and clean it cuts through grease within seconds it gets rid of any burn marks and it is just literally a miracle paste it honestly it just works wonders on your hob and this hob hasn't been this shiny in years i don't think i've actually given it a good shine since moving in so i'm really glad that i've discovered this because it has been a complete game changer So the pink stuff paste is amazing at getting rid of any rust and everything like that and as you can see my shower is looking pretty grim. I noticed the last time I cleaned the shower and I just didn't really know what to use it on and then I discovered this stuff. So I put it on, scrubbed it on again for about 5 minutes and wiped it off and it just all wiped away and it looks good as new. When I find things like this I do get so excited because I just assume that it has to look like that and nothing's going to fix it so when I find a product that's so easy easy affordable and just works wonders i do get very excited so i definitely recommend picking this up and giving it a go in your bathroom as well So when I saw what it did to the shower, it instantly made me think of the toilet tissue holder in the ensuite bathroom because I've been close to throwing this away so many times just because it's got lots of speckled rust on it and no matter what I use, nothing seems to get it off. So I have just been tempted to chuck it out and buy a new one. But as soon as I saw what the paste did on the shower, I grabbed this and gave it a go. And again, it worked like magic. It got rid of all of the rust and it's left it super, super shiny. So if you are thinking of throwing anything out because it's rusty, Definitely give this one a go before you throw it away because you can probably restore it and just make it look as good as new. Look how gross this dish is. I have tried everything to get this clean and I think it's been a couple of years that it's looked like this. I just thought it was stained and nothing could work on it. So I thought I would give it a go. I've not seen anyone use the pink stuff paste on a dish like this before. So I wasn't really sure how it was gonna work or if it was gonna work at all, but it blew me away again. It honestly just melted all of the stains and everything off and it looks good as new. So if you have anything in your kitchen that you're not sure whether it would work, definitely give it a go because it will probably surprise you but yeah i am so happy that i did try it on this because it's been years since it's been cleaned so this definitely makes me happy So 
So there's so many different ways to get coffee stains out of mugs, but I think this one might be one of my new favorites just because it's so quick and easy to do. All you have to do is wipe some of the paste in with a cloth and it literally took me one or two minutes and it was super clean. You didn't have to wait for the product to work or anything. So this one is definitely at the top of my list of favorites. And the final thing that I used it on was my frying pan. I know that it's one of the most common uses is on pots and pans. So I thought I would give it a go. This pan is a few years old. So the stains were very stubborn, but it still got rid of, I'd say 99% of it. It didn't get rid of everything, but I am super happy with how it did work. Just knowing that it's years old and it still made it look pretty much good as new is good enough for me. So I definitely do recommend it giving this a go if you haven't already, because there's just so so many different uses for it. I really hope that you've enjoyed today's video and I hope it's given you some helpful ideas on what you can use your pink stuff paste on. Do go ahead and leave today's video a thumbs up and also consider subscribing to my channel if you haven't already and I will see you back here in the next one.